What's going on guys? It's your boy Christian here back at you for Sneaker Talk with a brand new first impressions video. So I just got in my pair early of the Puma Thunder Spectra. These beautiful sneakers right here and oh my gosh, I want to say these might be a top contender for dad shoe of 2018 or dad shoe of the year, the Puma Thunder Spectra. So today what we're doing is throwing them on feet for their very first day of wear, see how they feel and uh, see how the public reacts to these sneakers or at least my friends. No, no, you gotta say too much. Young in Eglinton right now, this little shopping center. We're meeting up with the homies from Kenchi, Toronto. I'm picking up some sneakers from them, some Bape sneakers. They're like middlemanning a transaction for me. A subscriber reached out to me over Instagram DMs a few weeks ago, and uh, I'm finally getting the shoes today. The struggle is so real right now, trying not to get my new sneakers all dirty with this mud. These are the new Pumas. They look like Balenciaga. They're Balenciaga. When you wear these? Absolutely. But you? Hmm? Maybe. Who am I sponsor me? Like, they look like Balenciagas. You yeah. Know what I mean? like, the Triple S, yeah. 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 Guess how much they retail for? Less than 150 I think 150 Really? Yeah. yeah. So the other day I asked you guys the important question. If you were Team Vanilla Coke or Team Cherry Coke? Well, Richard, Team Vanilla Coke. So you should follow him at Richard Murphy. Ooh. You guys need to report Nathan on Instagram. This is unacceptable. I'm disappointed, man. I'm not. I ain't no vanilla. I ain't no vanilla. Only cherry. Would you rather have the Desert Rats or the Pumas I'm on, I have on feet? Before I answer that, yeah. the funny thing about the Desert Rats is that I thought they were called Desert Rats, but they're actually Easy 500s. Yeah. There's two colorways: the yeah. Desert Rats and the Blush, right? That's like, true. Yeah. it's weird. Like, I, I don't know. But to answer your question, I like the Desert Rats. Okay. Honestly, okay. but like, I'm not happy. Well, you just lost the team of sponsorship there. <laughs> <laughs> So you guys know that Kenchi Toronto just shut down and this is actually their new location so I get to give you guys a sneak peek at the spot. Check this out guys, check this out. A lot of inventory here as you guys can see. And uh, today I also get to show you guys my brand new pickup from Kenchi Toronto so let me show you guys that right now. So here we have it, we got some Adidas sneakers. Ooh, Ooh. got some Bape Dame 4s. Green camouflage colorway. Mess with these heavy. So uh, yeah, thank you Kenshi Toronto for holding it down. For now I'm taking back some of my sneakers because uh yeah, they don't they don't look like they're gonna move anytime soon. But what the heck? Oh I completely forgot to give you guys these Timberlands. Oh damn, I could have yeah. stole them. <laughs> but uh ooh, what are those? Oh, oh yellow EQTs. Bait, EQTs, cool. Yeah, you want them? What size are they? Size eleven. Nah, it's too too big. Sneaker shopping with Kenshi. Hold up. I had to flex on him real quick. Ooh, you won't, damn. you won't ever get this. You won't ever get this. These are nice. These are nice. I'm just gonna. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> so I just made it back home, and my mom's watching the Raptors game right now on TV, and the crazy thing is, Nathan and two of his boys, they all went to the Raptors game, and they're at game five of the Raptors playoffs for guess how much? Guess how much they pay for their tickets? $20 American each. Bruh, so cheap. They went at halftime, and uh, they got like seats 300 row or whatever, but yo, $20 to be at the Raptors playoffs, that's lit. More. Oh, my. Oh, yes. 
Day two, wearing the Puma Thunder Spectra, and uh, I gotta say, these sneakers are very, very comfortable. I was not expecting these shoes to be as amazingly comfortable as they are. So for that reason alone, and because I really love the uh, the silhouette in general, I'll probably be bringing these with me to my trip in Japan. So I'm about to grab some lunch real quick, but right beside my lunch spot I'm gonna get some food at is a value village. So let's quickly check out what they have here. Electronic section with some valuables. Ooh, they got a OG PlayStation 1 right there for 1999 Canadian. That's like 15 bucks US. Here is a look at the sneakers that they got. That's the kid stuff. Here is the men's and uh, not too much here. This, this, uh, Value Village is usually pretty dry. The best thing I think they have here would have to be these like Converse All-Stars. Oh snap, and they even got some Air Force One mids for the kids. Okay, okay. I do need to re-up on a fresh pair for the summer. My first impression of the Puma Thunder Spectra after a full day of wear and wearing it earlier today, I want to say it's a sneaker I can definitely recommend. These Puma Thunder Spectra only retail for 120 US dollars or 150 in Canada. I want to say that's a really, really good price point. I think these sneakers are honestly going to sell out the day of, if not the same weekend that they release because they allow everybody, straight up everybody, to get in on the dad shoe trend at a very affordable price point and it's genuinely a good looking sneaker. I prefer these more than the Yeezy Wave Runners. That's just my opinion and uh, I don't know, maybe you guys have the same opinion. Maybe you guys want to disagree. Let me know in the comment section down below though what you guys think about the $120 Puma Thunder Spectra. And are these gonna resell? I have no idea. One thing I know for certain though is I am looking forward to more colorways of the sneaker dropping later this summer. Hopefully they release them because there's no rumors of more colorways, but hopefully they do. So Puma, please, please release more colorways. In more Puma news, Puma and MCM. It is finally happening. I heard rumors about this earlier this year in Las Vegas at the MCM store. And uh, check it out. They got some Puma MCM Puma suede's right here. And and they're also releasing a jacket and track pants so like a full full track jacket set or a full set i think there's also like a puma mcm varsity jacket which looks really really dope you have like the mcm uh like that what's it called what's the color what's the proper color for the mcm like that brown champagne shade cognac i think it's called cognac with the cognac mcm branded sleeve i'm gonna have to cop that and i was actually planning to go to south korea later this year and cop myself some mcm there because that's the cheapest place you can buy mcm so maybe when i go the puma mcm stuff will release there at the same time that'd be pretty dope but uh yeah let me know if you guys are hyped about the puma mcm because i know quite a few of you guys have dm'd me asking me for more information that's all i know that's all the information i have Ay caramba it is tax season and taxes are not fun i will tell you that much hey misty what are you up to do you need water is nikki being a bad bad donor she's not giving you any water let's see her bowl nikki she needs water why didn't you give her any water ginger she doesn't drink ginger ale this is how Missy tells us if she wants water. She either hits the bowl or she lays beside the bowl and gives everybody mean looks until she gets her water. So there is some water for you. Yay, Misty drinking the water. Yeah. So there you guys go. That's going to wrap up today's vlog. Hope you guys did enjoy it. And if you did, please smash that thumbs up button down below. It helps me out a ton when you do. And of course, if you're new to the channel, maybe check out another vlog after this. The vlog I uploaded the other day with my girlfriend, the one on screen right now, I highly recommend you guys watch that one. It's probably one of my best vlogs as of the last few weeks. So check that out. Follow me on Instagram for outfits and sneaker photos if you haven't yet already. And by the way, my girlfriend now has Instagram, so follow her. It's up on screen, so yeah. Show her some love and comment your favorite anime on her most recent post because she wants to know what animes to watch next in Japan. Anyways, guys, keep on hustling, keep on grinding, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.